welcome back to my channel and welcome to a Christmas house tour. I'm so excited. Okay, so a Christmas house tour is basically taking you through the areas of the house that are decorated for Christmas. So it's not a full house tour, but I'm going to show you all of the bits that are Christmassy, that I've done up for Christmas. As you can see behind me, the corridor is like a winter wonderland. <laughs> So what I'm going to do for this video is I'm going to slot in the nighttime aspect of every area as well so that you get the full kind of this is what the house is like at night because it's completely different at night, completely different. Okay, so first of all when you walk up to our house from the outside, I've got two posts outside that are kind of wrapped with lights basically so they look like really bright posts when you enter the house and they're really twinkly and they're gorgeous and I've got a wreath on the door and I've got a little soldier as well at the front door got my little soldier he stands there every year pride of place at the front door and then I've got my wreath there and outside you can see the posts are wrapped now at night this is completely different <laughs> So walking in from the front door, we've got our little couch here. I think one year I'm going to get more cushions that are like Christmassy and I'll put some here. But um, this little guy on the floor, I think we got from Kmart the first year we arrived here. And he's been, ever since he's stood pride of place near the front door. He's absolutely gorgeous. Can't remember how much he was. I don't think Kmart do him anymore. And then we come to my Christmas village and my Christmas tree. So I'll talk you through my Christmas village. Most of these bits are from Kmart. This was from the Christmas shop one year. We splashed out. Um, it was quite expensive, but it was reduced from its full price. So that's why we got it. Um, but Christmas galore, I think it's called the shop. And these are all from Kmart. So if you saw my recent videos of what I got in Kmart. You'll, you'll have seen this one. This little thing was from A Dash of Christmas, that little Christmas shop that I visited a little while ago. And then I've got my little trees, bottle brush trees. These come in a pack of three from Kmart. This was also from Kmart. This one I think was from a cheap shop a few years ago, can't remember where. Um, this was from the Christmas shop also, the Christmas galore shop. We got that a few years ago as well. It's like uh, an infinity mirror. It goes on and on and on. It's really cool. I got this the other day from a little independent card shop. And this one was from Kmart. So the majority of everything really was from Kmart. And then if you look underneath, I've actually got a little display under here as well. So this was from Kmart last year. It's a little camper van. It's the cutest thing ever. I got him from a dash of Christmas. He was $10 from there. He's so, so cute. I love elves. As you can probably tell, I love elves. And he is just so awesome. The colors of him just go perfectly with this tree. Then I've got this with a couple of giant baubles in them, like I have on this tree. So I thought I'd incorporate that. And then I've got this. I got this from Kmart last year. Absolutely beautiful snow globe. And he was from Kmart as well. I think he was like $6 last year. Amazing. This was from A Dash of Christmas. Oh no, no, sorry. This was from Harbour Town, a little independent shop. And behind there, the Christmas sign, that was from Kmart last year. So it just all kind of ties in and looks, it looks purposeful. It's like organized chaos <laughs> sort of thing. Okay, and then we move on to my corridor tree. So 
This is the tree skirt that I got from Kmart in my last haul. I was going to use it for the big tree in the kitchen, but I couldn't because it's too big. <laughs> but I'll show you that in a second. So this is my corridor tree. So it's literally a winter wonderland with a dash of red. That's what I was going for. Snowy and Christmassy. <laughs> so all these little things here were from Kmart. And th that was last year, I got them last year. So it's just very kind of white and snowy and festive. And my tree topper is a little holly, not holly is it? I I'm, I'm not sure what the plant is, but it's a fake plant that I've just stuck in the top and that was from Kmart last year. So if you look all the way around, I've got them giant baubles dotted around. And then at the bottom, I've got my Kmart snowman. I showed you in my last haul, I got him this year. He was uh, probably about $8, something like that, ridiculously cheap. And then I've got this little mouse. My mum bought me that one year when she visited. And I got my little tree there, that was from Kmart the other year. So if you back up, you can see the whole of the tree in the corridor. It's absolutely beautiful on a night time when you're walking towards it. It's just gorgeous. The You might have spotted this. I got this last year from Kmart. It's basically a wooden hanging, well, these bits are wooden, with just a tapestry. Absolutely beautiful. And it's got light up spots on the trees. There's like a little battery pack in here. You literally just flick it on and off. And it's, it's just the most beautiful thing I think I've ever seen. And it was only $15, I think, last year. Don't think they're doing them this year, unfortunately, but it just sets off the corridor really nicely. Okay, so if we go into what we call the rumpus over here, it's like a um, a room for kids, basically. So my 15 year old son has this room because his bedroom's just there and he basically has the rumpus. So very simple in here, really. I've just put a Christmassy cushion on here with stags, gorgeous. Can't remember where I got that from. That was a few years ago. And then just in the center, I've got like a blanket in this little Ikea storage unit and table. And then I just basically put some baubles in this little centerpiece and some lights inside. And this is just a basic garland for a tree. I just thought that set it off really nicely. And then if you turn around, there's a unit, TV unit, and I've just, I always have these pillar candles and they just stay there all year. But I've threaded some warm white lights through that are actually on the tree, but I'll show you the tree in a second. And this was from Kmart last year. And these little signs, you got a pack of four as well. I've just put one there, two there, and one on that one. Pack of four last year, I got them from Kmart. I'm, I'm not sure if they're doing them again this year, but they would have been dirt cheap. Can't quite remember how much, but they would have been dirt cheap. And then I've got my little snowy scene on the floor. I've had that for a few years now. Absolutely love it. Again, a Kmart purchase. Majority of stuff's from Kmart. And then here's the tree. So this tree is a different color to the one in the corridor. This is like ice, icy colors so it's ice blue and white and sparkly silver and my topper is something I got from Christmas galore one year and it's just a lollipop <laughs> basically and these I got from Christmas galore as well it's like a sparkly thing and it just sticks out of the top and I just thought it really set it off don't really need a star on the top I do have a star for the top but I've just placed it there just so that it's got somewhere to sit, basically. So I'll back up a bit so you can see the whole tree. So that's what his rumpus looks like. Absolutely beautiful. And the stag, 
I got from Kmart one year. They are doing them again this year and him as well. Just beautiful. Love it, love it, love it, love it. And then if you walk out of the rumpus, you pass obviously this tree and then the picture. And then we've got the area where we do the washing and everything. And that's Baxter's area outside. And then we've got the garage. So I'll take you into the garage. So we do have, oh, we'll have Christmas music playing in here. I'm gonna have to turn that down. Okay, so this is the bar area. So what I've done with the bar area is just basically put some tinsel around the outside. I've put a bit of a garland around here that I got from Kmart the other year. And it's a berry garland. It's a beautiful, I love it. And I've put a little tree in the background as well and just a Merry Christmas candle. I think I got this from like a, a dollar shop and one year and just love it. It was about seven, seven dollars, something like that. Very cheap. So there's lights underneath the bar that on a night time light up the tinsel <laughs> to make it look pretty. And obviously this bit lights up as well. So just adds a little bit. And I've also got a poinsettia, poinsettia, I don't know how you say it. Um, plant on the side of the bar as well just to add a little bit extra and then I've got Christmas coffee shop jazz on in the background I love these things you just get them off YouTube basically type in Christmas coffee sh coffee shop ambience and it'll come up with so many it every so often the cars go past and there's people walking past and you can hear like chatter and things like that. Oh, it's just gorgeous love it so that's the bar. Christmassy all year round because it's constantly got lights in it. I love it. I got this from Dusk the other year. If you've watched me for a while, you've probably seen the video where I show you me doing this. <laughs> and then we've got the cinema. So I've got Christmas ambience on in this one, but it's a different one. This is somebody's living room with a fireplace on. It's just beautiful. And the only thing I've got decor wise in here for Christmas is this little tree. So this was from Kmart the other year. It's got its own little basket at the bottom. It's snow capped. And I got these little tiny lights as well from Kmart. And these tiny little baubles are purposeful for tiny trees. It's just gorgeous. Love it. And then I've got this little candle here. Just a Christmassy candle that I got from uh, TK Maxx, I believe I got that from TK Maxx. It just basically, it's not too much for this room, you know, it just kind of sets it off nicely. And it looks beautiful at night as well.
And then you turn to the right when you come out of the cinema and we've got the wet bar. So a wet bar is just basically where you keep your booze and your glasses and your wine. There's like a wine fridge down there. Um, and yeah, I've got just a little few things dotted around here. So we've got my naughty elf who's hugging my bottoms and baubles up glass. So he's, he's just, I love him. And then I've got this little star on top of one of the bottles because there was nowhere to put this star. So I thought, well, that's a nice place to put it. It just makes it, makes it look Christmassy. And then I've got a little elf sitting in one of my cocktail glasses. And then I've basically got, I love this. This was $3 from Kmart and I absolutely love it. I use it all the time. I use it for beer. I use it for wine. I use it for pop. <laughs> I just love it. And then I've just got a little candle here. This actually lights up. Why haven't I switched that on? There we go, that's better. So it lights up and these things spin around as well, float around, so nice. Then I've got a little gonk hanging here, just minding his own business. And then I've just got my glasses with some candy canes in them and another little gonk sitting on my measurer. So it just gives that area a little bit of Christmassy, a little bit of a Christmassy feel. So here's our bedroom. I haven't done anything Christmassy in here. <laughs> Um, just in case you were wondering if have I got a Christmas tree in here I haven't I have got three trees but obviously one of them's in the corridor the other one's in the rumpus and the next one I'm going to show you is in the kitchen but I've got a tiny little tree over there just sitting there minding its own business <laughs> but yeah um, maybe one year I'll have a tree in here but there's not a lot awful lot of room so I would have to figure it out and I'm desperate to change these carpets. I am so desperate to get rid of the black and get some grey carpets. We're just, uh, we're gonna have to save up a bit of money and do that because this is just no good. <laughs> I don't, yeah, I, I love it, but the carpets drive me insane. I just need to change them. <laughs> bedroom and then you see oh how gorgeous is that oh I love it so much well, I'll just go through what we've got moving through the kitchen so I've just got some lights here they're like star lights and I got these from Kmart they're just plugged in over there and I'm just I've just hung them on these candelabra things it looks better at night, I must admit, that does look better at night, as does everything. And then we've got this, I got this from Kmart last year, if you've watched me for a while, you might have saw my Kmart haul last year where I showed this. I love it. It was about $12 and it's just amazing. I love it so much. And then this garland, I got this from the reject shop in a recent haul a month or two back. It just takes batteries and I just love it. It's just an ideal place for it. It just sets off the kitchen. It just sets off this unit really, really well. Oh, look at that scene. How cute is that? This is another one of those YouTube Christmas ambience um, scenes. Isn't it gorgeous? The little cat in the middle, little tree, fireplace. Wow, I love it. Gorgeous. Okay, then I've got a little Merry Christmas candle burning over here, which smells delightful. And I've got my Days Till Christmas. I think that's wrong. I'm going to have to change that. And then I've got just a little scent here, and it's Christmas tree. And I got that from TK Maxx a little while ago. And then underneath, I've always got this lit up. It's always plugged in um, a, a set of lights under there so that it lights up. I love that. 
And then this little Christmas thing, I got this from an independent card shop sort of thing yeah, last year, I think. And then that, that little tin you might have seen that was going to go on my tea tray, but it ended up not going on there. So I put it there instead. Then we've got this little poofy that we put our feet up on. A set of three Christmas trees that I got from Kmart last year. It was a pack of three and it was dirt cheap and I absolutely love them. It just goes so nicely on this little tray. I've got my three Colette candles. I showed you them in a haul beginning of the year. Um, it was pretty much a after Christmas sale sort of thing. So they were dirt cheap. And then I've got my little snowman in the middle. He lights up, but he turns like green and red and stuff. And I, I'm not really that keen on it. So I don't really switch him on. And I've got my stags. Um, my stags throw that I always have on here all year and then just a couple of let it snow cushions I believe I got them from TK Maxx last year and then we've got outdoor which isn't I haven't really de decorated out there one year I'm going to decorate out out there and I'm going to have lights around there posts and things like that but for now I haven't <laughs> So moving on to the tree, if you've been watching me for a while and you watch my channel, you've probably seen my tree decorating video. But um, yeah, so I think I've already explained, I got these from Bunnings, I got the sleigh rides from Kmart, that sign from Kmart, he's from Kmart as well. I got him last year, bargain. He was from the Christmas shop, you'll probably have met him already, that's Walter. This is the little um, a little robin that I got from Kmart last year. And then I've got a little squirrel down here that I got from Kmart last year. Again, can't remember the prices because it, it's been a while. I really can't remember where I got him from. He's called Mickey and he's climbing up the branches to try and put one of the baubles on for me. He's very helpful. And then I've added a few crackers to the tree because I opened the pack of crackers to put over there in the background, which I'll show you in a second. Um, and it just pads it out even more, even more than it was before. I just love it. Absolutely love this area of the house. And then if you turn to, turn to the left. No, if you keep walking, <laughs> you see my tiered tree. So I've actually added to it a little bit since I did the tiered tray video. I've got more of these charging plates. These charging plates, $1.75 from Kmart. What a bargain. Absolutely love them so much. It just sets off the table so, so nicely. I never thought of doing that before. And then I saw them this year for $1.75 and I was like, yeah, I'm going to try it. And it looks great. Obviously, I've put a cracker on each plate. So it's all set up ready for Christmas. And then I've got my little tiered tray. This little train was from, K oh, no, no, I was going to say Kmart. That was from Choice. Actually, a lot of this little, these little trinkety things were from Choice. Um, that was from Kmart. That was from Kmart. This was from TK Maxx. You'll have seen that in my last haul if you watch all my videos. And then I got these salt and pepper shakers from Kmart as well. He was part of the set. So I thought I didn't just want to have the little tiered tray in the middle. I wanted it to be like a whole area going on. So that's why I've got this chopping board with things on it as well in the background. That little Santa was from Choice. He's beautiful. This stag was from the reject shop. It was $18, I think, something like that, which I thought was really, really good. That's Elliot's little glass. It's just got a couple of candy canes in. Oh, wow. <laughs> I can't believe I keep forgetting to switch things on. So there's my Santa mug. I love this. This is a Ray Dunn piece. I've got my candy canes in here. Um, little dangly leg guy, just absolutely love this area so, so much. And again, at night, it just is beautiful.
so I hope you enjoyed having a nosy around my house, all the areas that are decorated for Christmas. It's, um, it's been a labor of love. I absolutely love decorating for Christmas. I actually, uh, if you're wondering about my YouTube studio, that's not decorated yet. And that is going to be in a coming video because I haven't done it yet. And it's a bit of a storage area at the moment. So that's why I haven't been in there. But we will decorate it. We'll make that a whole separate video. Um, because yeah, I couldn't show you that today. It's just a mess. <laughs> But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this Christmas tour of my house and I'd love to see you in my next video. Please click subscribe if you're not already so that you can see what I bring out next. Like I said, I've got back to back advent calendar unboxings to do throughout December as well. So that's really exciting. I'm so excited to do that and I can't wait to see you then. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye. Mwah. Thank you.